All right, let's get into it. Uh, let's start with opening this pack with the free 99 Alec Mills, who pitched a no-hitter, so he's getting a free 99. Pretty good. Uh, put him in for Hershiser. He's been struggling lately, why not? He will be getting a debut, by the way. I don't see why not. Gilito got one, so why can't he? Uh, but let's move on to... Uh, the moments. Let's do them. Wow, these are actually really easy. Okay. Pretty easy moments. Hey, Poppy Quick. Hey. Hello, son. Yo, what's up, Jackson? Alright, let's see how this Anthony Rendon swing is. Is Jeez, struggled to speak right there. Curious if it's any good. It's been a while since I've got to watch. It's all good. You're catching the stream. How you doing? Not bad. So I need to tie two extra base hits and three hits in a single game. All right. I mean, I'm facing Zach Wheeler. I prefer that. Did you guys want to see debut first, by the way, at Rendon or Alec Mills? Wow. How slow is Rendon? Did he just hit that really hard to the wall, or is he slow? 47 speed's pretty weak. Do both? No, I'm doing both, but which one do you want to see first? I'm not going to do both in one vid, though. I don't like doing double debuts. Yeah, they'll just each get their separate video. I'm just curious which one you guys want to see first. Alec? Oh shit. It's split. Rendon and Alec. One on one. Okay, I'm gonna restart this. Well, if it's split, then I guess I just have to decide for myself. Alright. G-Man Choi? Oh, I thought you meant, when you said you should Choi, I thought you meant that you should choose? Yeah, I'll just end up choosing. Doesn't really matter. That's gotta be gone, right? That's gotta be gone. Oh yeah, okay. Is anybody else shocked that 2019 Rendon's not even worth a 99? I thought he did like really fucking good last year. Oh, late on it.
the fuck am I supposed to do there? He didn't... Uh, we gotta restart. Bomb of the 7th. Most likely not getting another up at no point. Uh, veteran difficulty and the guy didn't throw me a single ball even near the strike zone in that at bat. Holy shit, what is his control? It's above average, so I don't really understand why he is not willing to throw me a strike. Still not a single pitch in the strike zone. And then a hanging changeup. God damn it. Oh, it's gone. Wow. How in the fuck is that a three run shot? That's a two run shot. Holy shit, my door won't fuck off. Okay, maybe get two more bats. Maybe. If I hit into a double play, I'm definitely not getting a second at bat. Okay, done. Yeah, I was actually just checking real quick to see if it was at good volume. The music in the background. And it is. We're all good. God damn it, really a perfect, perfect single on an up and in fastball. That's it. Damn, what a play. All right, yeah, restart. Restart. At least it wasn't a line out. It happens to me all the time. Eh, I wouldn't really care about the line. In a rank game, of course, I would, but this is moments. Oh, no, that's not getting by him. Fuck. And he's throwing it to the cutoff, man, so I'm up by a mile. <laughs> oh, fuck, he actually... That really tells you how slow Rendon is, is when he just got ran... He just got run out right there. That's... Jesus, man, like, Rendon is slow. There you go.
Yep, that's getting down. That's the last extra base hit. There we go. We should play ranked later. Eh. I don't like playing ranked on stream because I'm too much of a pussy uh, with my record. And I don't like playing ranked that much in general. I like facing uh, subs a lot more because it's a lot more casual. Events? I would say yes pretty much all the time if it was in this current event. There's no way you can't agree with me that this event right now is the worst of the year. This current event is the fucking worst. It is one of the hardest, and it gives you the worst rewards. Uh, can we play? Yeah, if you have me on PSN, just hit me up whenever you want to play, and if I got a debut guy, we can play. You should sell Batances and buy Dibble. I have no reason to. Batances is doing good. If he does shit, then probably, yeah. What's my PSN? Same as my YouTube. Quick on. Same thing. Ugh. They're probably going to call that a hit. Oh, wow. They actually got it right. Okay. They usually don't. This guy's throwing away a lot. I need to be on that. Paige Lind Hoodrat. I'll just accept it real quick so I can get it done. <laughs> Good name, dude. Paige Lind Hoodrat. God, the loading time on this fucking PS4, man. So bad. Yo, what's up, effects? Oh my god, Lady Gamer. You goaded? Fuck yeah. I'll take it. Woo! She gone. Alright. You gotta? I gotta what? You're going to beat me, but I just want to have a fun game and hopefully no Kluber. Oh, you're hoping I don't pitch Kluber? Dude, I don't even have Kluber in my rotation anymore. I don't have fun using him anymore. So you don't got to worry about that. Since you asked um, to have for me to debut Mills first, though, I'll pitch with Alec Mills. I'll use him. Debut him against you.
You gotta be good to be able to hit with that shit of a player, Anthony Rondon. Damn, dude. You don't like this card that much, huh? Kluber is not even that hard to hit anymore? Yeah, he's not. That's why I took him out, mainly. He was being hit pretty hard. People were starting to figure him out. But at the same time, it just wasn't fun anymore. It's just like after 300 innings, I'm just like, uh, you know, I think I'm done. He's ass? I don't mind his swing. He probably doesn't have much of a power swing, though. I can guarantee that. And online, his swing probably just doesn't produce much pop. Guarantee this car cannot hit any away pitches for shit, though. Rather use 96 Cole Hamels than Kluber. I can't stand that form from the stretch, so I couldn't, I couldn't stand using that card. Oh, come on. Just early. Oral Hershiser is my favorite pitcher to pitch with because of his control. Yeah, he's one of my favorite too. I took him out of the rotation real quick though just for Alec Mills. But he's definitely one of my favorite. You don't have Hershiser? Dude, you gotta pick up Hershiser. He's filthy. <laughs> Dude, yeah, no, that would be the absolute fucking worst. I'd be pretty pissed about that. But I, I make sure to not make mistakes like that. I've done it. I've done stuff like that before, and I was really pissed off. I had a roll of Chapman. I didn't lock him in. I was very careful with that one. Did not want to lock in Chapman. But yeah, if I was still doing Trent and I locked in 99 Wagner, I'd, I'd fucking. I'd, my, I, I would have quit the game. I would have quit the game. Or at least started a new account just because I'd be that mad. I'd feel like I fucked up that much. Unless you know the card's like absolutely filthy. And worth, you know, the million stubs. But I doubt he is. Two innings away from Prestigium? Nice. I don't know how close I am. I think I'm still quite a ways away. There just hasn't been an event that I've wanted to play consistently for a while that actually has the face of the franchise cards in it. This one does, but it's unbearable to play in. Unfucking bearable. You have no prestige people or close? Dude, what are you doing? How do you not have anybody close? You think Bellinger and Yelich will go gold? I think, he, no. Um. Interestingly enough, I'm pretty sure Yelich has no chance of going gold because his OPS is still there. If you go to look at the guy, if I remember correctly, unless he's shit the bed recently, which I don't... Oh, boy, he's hit 195. Yeah, 98 OPS plus 744 PS. Yeah, never mind. He's probably going gold. Uh, a few weeks ago when he was still hitting 200, he still had a high OPS and a good OPS plus because... He was at least walking and stuff a lot, but no, he's definitely going gold. Cody Bellinger, though, I'm not sure about him. He's hitting 215, 707. Yeah, no, they might both go. I don't know. They might both go gold. His slugging's 412, not even close to his career average. Yeah, you know what? They might both go gold. They're both really struggling. Is it just tops now? I might start playing again. Is what just top now? Tops now. This update? 
You got this guy, and that's it. And then it's the Anthony Rendon. Dead ball is the worst event ever. Yeah, it really is. It and you know, did you hear about the second one? The worst part is that this is going on for the for a month, and dead ball two is only silver and bronze hitters. It's already bad enough with diamonds. Can you play ranked? Nah, man, I'm good. I don't like playing ranked that much. Not a fan. It is very rage inducing, and I just I uh, can't stand it. I'll play like one game a week, but I've already played a game this week. Here to get this Rendon, and that is it. Lower than 90? I think Scherzer definitely will. I don't know how Arenado is doing, so I can't say anything about him. Let's do this. Let's just go beat the Nationals. Who's a pitcher with a fast form? I got glass now, but is there anybody quick also up here? Nobody like Glasnow, I don't think. Ah, oh, it's you, Darvish. We'll go with you, Darvish. Play BR. Yeah, you guys are fucking nuts. All right, calm down. No online here. Not today. Which one's faster, home? I don't know. I might start doing stuff like that. PR streams and stuff. Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm thinking about it, but I'm not crazy on it. Ranked seasons. I don't like playing a bunch of ranked games in a row. Hate it. Can't stand it. I lose my sanity. No, I'm good on that. BR? Maybe. I don't take it as seriously. Can I play you later? Uh, Are you on my PSN list? On my, PS, uh, on my PlayStation friends? I'm not sure. A lot of people have added me. You got to grind for the 2012 no nameplate. Uh, I would probably lose all of my hair before that happens. When can I play you? Uh, just hit me up whenever, and I will tell you if I'm available. That's really just what you got to do. Before, I would hit you up, but now it's just like I got a bunch of no's when I did ask last time. So I was just like, shit, all right. Well, this isn't working out because, you know, at moments, people will not be available. So, just hit me up whenever. I don't care. Like, hey, if I say no, don't take it bad. I just, I'm not available at the moment. That's all. So, yeah. You ask me whenever you want, and I'll tell you if I'm available to play. Um, just know today we're not playing for sure. Uh, I got stuff to do with my friends tonight. Tomorrow, uh, sometime in the afternoon or later in the night, I'll probably be available at any point then. Just sub, man. Yo, appreciate it, Drew. Uh, effects, just, uh, add me on PSN. My, uh, PSN is quick lives on. Fucking Juan Soto, man. There we go. You have prestige Paxton, Bellinger, Chipper, and Kerry Wood. Nice. You almost have Paxton not too far? I don't know how close I am. I, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty far off from him. I have like a 5 ERA with him, so I'm not a fan. Not a fan of using him. What do you sell your bosses? Sanchez 
Early on everything. Yeah, everything's pretty slow against CPU. And everybody has the habit of just swinging at everything against CPU. Oh, that explains it. No wonder you don't have any prestige cards then, or barely any. Are you taking from the 8th inning program? I'm taking Kershaw, but I'm buying everybody else. I like all of them, so I'm picking up all of them. I sold Kershaw because he was going for 250k and got Mantle. Yeah, I mean, that's a pretty good trade. Getting Mantle for selling Kershaw, that's not bad. Two run shot, damn. High sinker does not get the CPU, dude. Fuck. This U Darvish is not blowing anything by the fucking CPU. This is all-star difficulty. And U Darvish can't blow a single pitch by them. Once they get to a two-strike count, they fell off everything. It's disappointing. Manto Biggio. And I really like Biggio. Yeah, a lot of people do like that card. <laughs> that's interesting. My, that's an interesting mindset. I took Avon because no other YouTuber did good with it. Interesting, interesting concept. I like it. Nobody did good with the card, so I'm taking it. Fuck yeah. I mean, actually, I'm, I think Pudge is going to be amazing. I was really good with his 91, I think. Hit like 350 with that card. So I'm excited to use him. You were watching my stream when I was going for 91 Pudge? Dude, I didn't even remember that I streamed that. That must have been a while back. Been around for a good bit then. That had to be in like the first week of the game. You are talking about getting the game? Oh, okay. That's cool to hear. Hopefully you're enjoying it. Oh, no other YouTuber did that great with Kershaw. Really? Oh, interesting. Okay. I'll see how I do with him. Oh, fuck it, be a two-run shot, you son of a bitch. Yeah, they're doing pretty good this year. He got hit around. Dude, don't worry me like this. I really want that car to be good. It's that velocity. It's not even that bad. He threw 99 last year, but 95 should be able to do the job. Hopefully.
You hate his 12 6 curve? You hate facing it? Yeah, it's pretty slow. Kluber throws 95 also. Well, I thought he threw a bit harder. And he does get hit a bit hard now. Hmm. Interesting. Although in Hall of Fame, I'd say in Hall of Fame or higher, Kluber can be pretty filthy. It's on All-Star when he becomes pretty hittable. Jesus Christ, Arvish, can you fucking, like, stop walking? Uh, Mad Bum. 98 maximum Gardner is pretty good. I can dot with that card. God damn. What a play. Play an all-star because your ass? Hey, man. Practice makes perfect. One thing that's really, really uh, good for practicing Hall of Fame is just going into the challenge of the week. I usually like doing that before I go into a game of Hall of Fame. Just everything looks slower after a few sessions of the challenge of the week. Everything looks slower. And you can just, you can watch the pitch. You can time it better. You can see where it's going to go better. It's weird, but it works. You play on All-Star and Ranked? Um, yeah, I still play All-Star too because I'm in wildcard. It takes a while to get out of All-Star difficulty. It goes from like 400 to 600 to the end of 600. Can't react to a fastball? Really? Fastball out of all pitches? Most people can hit the fastball in this game. It's the off speed. Can't react to a fastball. I'm slow. Wow, this team is sucking this inning. Can't hit high fastballs that good? That's my sweet spot. High, high fastballs are pretty nice bitches for me. But once you start sitting off speed, man, ooh, if they're throwing that, it can get really nice. Really nice hitting off speed. Okay, yeah, that is a three run shot. You know, good reaction time? I actually struggle to have good reaction time, too. I'm either having really good reaction time or just absolute dog shit reaction time. All over the place. Hit it and play, man. Let's get through this game. You love playing the CPU like the Dodgers on Legend? For practice, or do you just like enjoying it? Or do you just enjoy playing it in general? Just fun to play. That's a fucking home run. God damn it. Both? Mm, all right. That would make you a pretty fucking good Hall of Fame player.
Even though you're playing on Legend, I get that, but they make Hall of Fame seem a lot easier to hit. Really struggle with the off-speed stuff? Most people do. Because you got to be ready for that fastball and those higher difficulties. So adjusting to the off-speed when you're waiting for a fastball is pretty fucking tough. Finished all that already? You got Rendon done? Nice. Okay, let's get Danny Dims warmed up and Hoffman. Yeah. Does Hall of Fame just come in faster? Yeah, every pitch is faster the higher the difficulty goes. It's my first year playing DD, so I'm learning. I hit World Series last season, but this season I'm in a slump. Damn, dude, that's tough. Yeah, just keep on practicing. Hopefully, you'll get out of it. Yeah, good shit, Lucio. You using them at all? Or did you just get them for the points? Nope. <laughs> I'm 12 and 3 in rank. That's not terrible. Not above 500. Are you a really good pitcher then? What's your ERA? This swing is nice though. Good power, good fielding. True. I don't mind swing. Although I feel like it's not going to have that much power behind the swing. Like three this season? That's pretty good. That's pretty good for this game. Most people have like a four minimum. Most people do have a four ERA. Something around there. Pretty sure like all the top players have like a six. But they score a shit ton of runs. Damn, that's pretty good. Sub three. You're 64 and 22. Dude, how the fuck are you ass if you're 64 and 22? What are you on about? That's a pretty damn good record. Overall, you're like 4.5. Oh, okay. Yeah, that sounds about right. 4.5, that's what most people have. That's a two-run shot, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's actually really good on All-Star. Here's the thing. It's easier not to give up runs the higher difficulty you go. So having a sub-3 is pretty good. Yeah, but I'm still ass. What do you... Oh, are, are, do you stick in the low ratings? So you face, like... Are you just saying you face easier opponents? Is that all? Those 22 losses are from, like, really fucking good guys? I'm, like, 130 and 75 and ranked for my first year playing. That's pretty good. 50 wins above 500? Pretty good. Well, just under 50 wins. Or is it... No, what am I saying? No, you're just over. Just over 50 wins. No, I'm 720. Oh, okay. What's your record? Uh, 80 and 18? I think... I think. I'll have to check. I think that's what it is. Yeah, that's pretty good. I don't play that often, though. Because I know, because of my record, because I... I uh, it's just, it's my competitive mindset. I care about my record. So, 
when I play a bunch of ranked games and if I lose, I get pretty fucking mad. I get pretty mad. I hate losing. That's why I'm pretty hesitant on no money spent to play because I'm like 29 and 0. Dude, I'm not better than Coogs. Coogs, I'm not even gonna lie, that guy's pretty fucking good. That guy's pretty solid. He might be a little annoying, but he's a good player. Yeah, I'm normally spent. It's pretty easy to be normally spent this year, in my opinion. I get nervous playing ranked, same. Only though, only when I'm in a World Series push do I get uh, nervous. Strangest thing is though, I get nervous when playing my own account. But if I'm playing somebody else's account, I can get a World Series no problem. Because I don't give a shit about the record. So I don't get nervous at all. 251 and 219, also pretty solid. A lot of games played. Jeez, voice crack. A lot of games played though. Yeah, see, like, that's the thing. I want to play as many games as you do, Lucio, but I either get too nervous, I get too competitive, I get too mad, I just stop. I just stop. Who are you pitching with? Um, pitching with the 94 you Darvish in this game, if that's what you're asking about. How much do I charge to get to World Series? Dude, I don't charge for that. I don't do it. I did it for my brother. Who am I pitching with? Wait, was I not pitching with you Darvish there? Was I pitching with my cap? Did I take him out without even realizing? I'm not gonna lie, if I'm pitching with him, I didn't even realize. I just instinctively did it, I guess. I don't know, I didn't even realize, did I? Holy fuck, what's going on with me? I thought I, I thought he was warmed up with the pen and all, but I didn't remember taking him out. Jesus, okay. Yeah, no, it's my creative player then. Easily, he's easily my best pitcher. He's so filthy. He's got zero ERA in 16 innings online, I'm pretty sure. He's got like 30 strikeouts, something like that. Nobody touches him. He's got like a .3 whip. Oh, damn, what a diving catch. I played a lot the first couple seasons, but just played to get to World Series now. I really just want to get to World Series once earlier in the year when they put a Dodger in there, but I just don't have any incentive to really go for World Series anymore, so I just play for content. How do you change your caps pitches? Uh, you just go down a certain uh, path. So like you want to go to down velocity, he'll have certain pitches. You want to go down control, he'll have certain pitches. Just stuff like that. Went 10 to no last season, put shitty the bed, put shit the bed this season. Was your record really fucking bad this season? Never been over a 500 rating? Well, if you're 12 and 3 on the year, that's why. And you also haven't played that much, right? Because you were gone since the second inning. You've been gone for six innings, so. Makes sense. I'm scared to play, too. What, do you get nervous around just, just at that rating? It's like 10 and 6. Oof. Yeah, it's pretty rough compared to 10 and 0. What path you go down? I think I went down velocity because I do throw 100. Look at that amazing swing. God damn. Throw me an edible pitch so I can hit it and play. My God. 
Oh, so you're just struggling at the uh, at the plate pretty bad. Throw like Chris Sale though. Yeah, except way more submarine. It's Tyler Rogers for him. In any DD, I've never been over 500 rating. Dude, you're getting nervous way too quickly. 500 rating's not that big of a deal. It's only halfway. Oh, you play Avant and BR a lot? Yeah, I play Avant a lot, not BR. Yeah, that ain't a good combo at all. Oh, damn right, I'm ready for that uh, moment's extreme. Apparently, it's it will showdown extreme. Isn't it an entire program? Like a bunch of stuff? It's not just showdown, right? It's a lot more than that. Which I'm pretty hyped about. Yeah, I think it'd be a little too broken though if you could make a switch pitcher. People will be pretty pissed about that. Always have the matchup advantage. That'd be pretty broken. You better go play one ranked game. Good luck, man. Dude, I'm so hyped for that. I hope. Has a lot of playing with your DD team against CPU. I love the babe grind. Yeah, the babe grind was pretty decent. I mean, eh. I wasn't a fan of it literally just being CPU games. I feel like they could have been a bit more creative with it. But I guess it's fine. Because they literally did that last year. Where we just did signature teams. And it was CPU games, CPU games, CPU games, CPU games. Just mildly CPU games. I'm a lot... I'm a much more bigger fan of them doing the stuff like showdown showdown could be a lot more interesting your guy would be the best pitcher in the game yeah easily thanks bro no problem man you got this you got this it's time to hit 500 get that diamond One more out, and I can finish off this game, and Rendon is unlocked. Them 20 stars, I think, away, pretty much. I did the Bay program, but I can't win the Hall of Fame games. Okay, so wait, but you didn't finish the Bay program, right? Because if you didn't do the Hall of Fame games, you can't finish it, I don't think. I like to grind the free card in MLB 20. And I made it to the World Series 5 out of 7, and right now I don't mind not making it because I have all the free card. And top snow card and in MLB and 99 try in the collection rewards. Yeah. I feel like after you hit World Series once, you, I feel like there is just no incentive. You hit it five times like good shit, but after hitting it once, I feel like there is no incentive of hitting it again. You've hit, you've gotten that achievement, you've gotten to that point. Like, unless you got a card in there that you really fucking want, you can't buy it, there's no point. 
Like, I have stubs, so I don't really find a need for it. No, I didn't finish it. You got any tips? Um... Uh, take till two strikes. That's probably a good one. They don't throw it like any strikes. So that's not a bad one to go with. Try that out. Um, there is a pattern. to if, if you're giving up a lot of runs, there is a pattern to them. You really just got to mix your pitches and they'll, they won't be able to touch you. No matter what difficulty you're on, CPU cannot touch you if you mix your pitches. Yo, what's up, Luis? Got 1.5 mil, but always want more. Jesus, the greed. I respect it. The new 99 pitcher actually looks pretty good. It doesn't look bad. It throws a bit slow, though. A little too slow. Yeah, they have bombs. Yeah, you gotta mix your pitches then. Says the person who has 800k and has Casey Mize in his rotation. I don't have Casey Mize in my rotation. Not anymore. I sold him. I'm losing all my stubs because I bought Max Scherzer. I uh, bought Frank Thomas and Larry Walker. Todd Helton. What the fuck did I lose all my stubs to? I think I lost the majority of my stubs because I lost so many stubs on Casey Mize trying to sell them back. Speed differently is good. He looks like a mini Greg Maddox. Oh, Greg Maddox gets fucked up by like everybody though. Max is a beast for me. Max Scherzer, yeah, he's he's fucking amazing. I, I'm loving him. Rendome's arm strength is worse than mine. Our IRL, wait, what is it? Jesus fucking Christ! They're fucking up that card, man. Okay, what's my ranked season record? Seventy six and eighteen. I thought I had 80 wins, but apparently not. Alright. What's you Darvish in CR right now? Is he getting fucked by CPU? Yeah, not really. Plus shit, he just, okay. Did you pull Max or buy on my bottom? Lock in your Redone? I did. Locked in. Now 19 stars away. From a Kershaw debut. What are their price now? Are they, are they down to like... Ooh, they're getting pretty fucking close to me buying them. Once they hit like 110, that's when I lock in on buying them. Hmm, that, that'll be fucking done soon. I could probably just get this done with my next ranked game. Which I'll probably end up doing tomorrow. Debuting Rendon, maybe? Maybe I'll do a ranked game with Rendon. He looks ranked eligible on All-Star. How about you donate me 150k, please? I could use it. <laughs> I pulled Todd Helton and Max and Duke. My headliners are out. God damn. Bro, I tried Josh Donaldson's swing on my cap, and his swing as a lefty is sexy. You should try it. Well, I don't even use a creative player as a hitter. I use this guy, and that's it. Look at that. Fucking filthy. If Cruz goes diamond, I'm banking. I, th I have 80 of him. God damn. How much is that car going for? Probably not anything really right now. Holy shit. Okay. All right, boys. Welp, that's probably going to do it for the stream today. Uh, this will be the only video going up today. Uh, my friends have something planned, actually. Can he hit two? Not really. No. He's got a stance and all, but the guy cannot fucking hit. Uh, but no, um, the starter can. The starter can hit. A little. But uh, yeah, my friend's got something planned for us tonight. We're actually going to play some games tonight. Uh, brand new one we just got. Probably going to be streaming on Twitch, if you want to see that. Quick lives on, on Twitch. But, uh, yeah. No video coming up today. We got a debut, and probably no money spent coming up tomorrow. Probably both coming up tomorrow. Be on the lookout for that. But, uh, yeah, guys, it's going to do it for the stream. I'll see you later.
Peace.